Hello wine people, do you know five stages of a vineyard cycle? Winter dormancy, bud burst, shoot and leaf growth, flowering and fruit set, verizon and berry ripening and harvesting. Winter dormancy is when the temperatures are low, shoots become woody and are called canes, wine stores its carbohydrates in its roots, winter freeze can be a problem in this period. Bud burst happens in spring when the outside average temperature is around 10 degrees Celsius. Buds swell, burst and grow shoots. This initial growth is supported by the carbohydrates that the vine stored over the winter. Vine grows leaves that creates glucose and supports vine's growth. Good amount of water and nutrients is needed for the wine in this period. Flowering and fruit set happens at the beginning of summer. Warm, dry, sunny conditions are needed in this period for the flowers to get pollinated. Otherwise, color can happen, which is a high amount of unpollinated grapes, which can reduce yields. And grapes can grow without seeds, which is called Miller and Dash. Verizon and berry ripening happens at the beginning of autumn. Berries need around eight weeks to grow between berry set and verizon. Verizon is when the grapes in the vineyard start to change their color. This is a sign that the berries are starting to ripen. They change their color, acidity falls, sugar level rises, flavor and tannin ripen. Warm sunny conditions are needed. Slight water stress can actually encourage berry ripening. Green harvesting can control yields and improve grape quality. Harvest starts at the end of autumn. Ideally conditions should be dry. Rainfall just before harvest can swell the grapes with water, dilute flavors and create rot. Any chemical spray needs to stop way ahead of the harvest so there's no chemical residues inside the wine. Let's simplify wine together. Stay thirsty and wise.